Aha, Blast Off Vengeance Gravity Regen Creeper, we meet again. Oh, for Sparta! God damn you! Oh, but no! Oh, for God's sake. What's going on guys, my name is James, or thanks see ya, and welcome back to another Minecraft mod spotlight, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Infernal Mobs mod. So yeah, this is a really cool mod, and what it actually does is, well it, it doesn't add any new mobs into the game, but what it does is it takes the existing mobs, and it gives them the percentage chance ability to spawn with these amazing enchantments which do stack and effectively turn mobs into basically like mini bosses so it's really really cool uh when i mean enchantments as well i don't necessarily mean the things that you can normally see in mobs in default and i don't mean that they spawn with special weapons or whatever uh yeah you'll see but uh, these abilities do stack and they can make them quite tricky to kill so yeah secondly you may be thinking james why is there loads of random tower thingies houses well because there's only a random percentage chance of these mobs spawning, I thought the best way to do it would be to try and trap some in little huts so I could kind of show you them one by one. And uh, yeah, that's what we're going to do. So in each of these huts contains a different zombie. Now, I'm going to be working with the zombies uh, for this mod spotlight majorly, but uh, they do actually happen on any um, sort of aggressive mob. So after we finish with these zombies, I might just try and spawn in some skeletons and some creepers and show you some of the cool enchants on that. But uh, yeah, we're actually going to swap into survival mode. And uh, yeah, we're going to show you these one by one. So yeah, let's start from here. Now the difference between these and normal mobs are that they have this special effect which comes on them. Now this one here, if you point the you know, cursor towards it, this is called a fiery poisonous rare zombie. And as you might suggest when you hit it, A, it turns you on fire, like so, and it also has the ability to poison you. So this is pretty tough, and um, as you can see it, it kind of has a decent amount of health, but yeah, the effects are pretty nasty on this one. Now, as you saw there, it has the ability to both poison and set you on fire. And, uh, yeah, I suppose that that was kind of a fairly weak one in terms of the abilities and also in terms of the drops. Now, the drops are very important because this kind of makes the mod worthwhile. So... Uh, the difference between them, basically, is that you'll gain four times the amount of experience when killing these uh, from a normal mob, and you also have a chance to have a an enchanted item drop, which could either be a weapon or it could be a piece of armor. So here we have one called a Weakness Rust. Now, there's a ton of different, like, kind of things. As you can see here, it's made as weak, so that's kind of a, an ability that it has. Ooh. There we go, we've got some boots, and these are, wow, these are Protection 3 and Feather Falling 4 enchanted golden boots, so that is pretty cool. Now, there's plenty of different enchants and stuff, uh, we've only seen a couple of them, there's, I've counted probably around 9 or 10 different ones so far. Um, so we've seen Poison, we've seen Weakness, and we've seen Rust, but this is the next one here called Ninja Darkness, so, oh my god! What the hell, so it's, it's cast us into darkness, and it's, it's, it, what was that, like a, a Thunderbolt or something? Amazing. But uh, yeah, this is a kind of a tough one because it does really change what you can see around you and it makes it a little bit tricky to see. But uh, yeah, as you can see, we've, we've felled him and we've got ourselves a Fire Protection 1 Diamond Helmet. And uh, yeah, let's move on. So we've seen Ninja, we've seen Darkness, we've seen Poison, we've seen Fire, and I can't remember the next one. Uh, but yeah, let's see what else we've got in here. So this fellow is a Ninja Gravity Ender. So it's getting kind of cool now in terms of the ones that we can see. And oh! Oh, okay, okay, as you can might expect, he teleported away with the Ender ability, he sent the Lightning Bolt down with the Ninja ability. I'm not sure what the Gravity ability is. I have no idea, I'm gonna let you hit me a few times. What is the Gravity? Oh, I guess we'll never find out. <laughs> but we got a Smite 3 Golden Sword from him. So you may be thinking that this is like really, really overpowered. Uh, well, these things aren't too randomly spawning, you know, they're not crazily all over the place. I probably would say that I found one in every 20 mobs that I encountered. So in the desert, there's going to be more of them than in the, the, you know, the forest, for example. But they're, they're not that commonly spawning. So although that I have actually spawned these in myself here, uh, you know, they're, they're not crazily overpowered at least. So, I mean, although they do drop very good items and they do give you decent XP, uh, you know, you're not going to be able to kind of go cheaty mode very, very quickly. But yeah, this is the last one for the zombies. We have a poisonous fiery rust ender, which is ah. So it set you on fire, and it's it's poisoned me as well, and he's not teleported away. But oh, god damn you! There we go. And the drop from him. Well, we have some blast protection to chain boots. So yeah, nice. Now, as I did mention, 
can't see if I've done any more little huts. I don't think so. So I'm actually going to try and spawn in here a few different ones. And we're going to see how we go. And I'm actually going to change into creative mode here. Because I might have to spawn a few. But I'm just going to demonstrate really that they do spawn with different ones. So here we have a creeper. And we have a skeleton. And uh, let's have a look see what we can get here. So, yeah... It's kind of a... Oh, there we go. So this one is a, a regen vengeance ninja sprint. So when we hit this guy, he... Uh, what happened to him? Actually, you know what? Is there anything behind me? It's off mode. Okay, right. So as you can see, this guy... Oh, God, this is not good. This is not good at all. I've not thought this through. Ah, oh, Jesus. <laughs> which one's, the, which one's the, the real one? Oh, there it is. Okay, so... He kind of regens his health, which is another enchantment that we can see here. So it's a bit tricky. And oh my god, there's a spider as well. <laughs> no. Oh. Okay, so it comes with spiders. As you can see, that was a randomly occurring spider. But yeah, it's now a randomly occurring dead spider. Uh, we didn't quite see what the enchant was on that. But we picked up a helmet. So that's kind of cool. What else have we got here? Skeletons. Oh, hang on. Creative mode. So let's try a skeleton. See what we can get. Uh, that's, that's just a normal skeleton. Oh. Why did you explode? What? Man. I did not expect that. But okay, right, let's carry on here. Um, da -da 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 -da. Oh, there we go. So this one is a fiery poisonous. That's not too exciting. This is a sprint quicksand regen. So that sounds awesome. Let's uh, let's go survival mode on him. Whoa! So as you can see, he runs really, really fast. Where has he gone? Ah! He runs really, really fast. He kind of sprints at you. And um, I'm not sure what quicksand is, actually. Unsure, but uh, yeah, it, as you can see, it's kind of just a mod which adds a ton of really, really cool enchantments into the game. It's not too sort of commonly spawning as well, so you could effectively take these mobs as mini bosses. But it's a great exam, a uh, great you know uh, opportunity. That's the word I'm looking for to get yourself a lot of experience and to get yourself some nice enchanted weapons. And if you are very lucky, you will start picking up things like diamond gear, uh, you know, efficiency and breaking that kind of stuff. So it's kind of just up to you to go exploring and try and find these fellas. And uh, when you do, try and take them down in one piece. So yeah, that is it for this mod spotlight. I do hope you guys enjoyed it. Incidentally, if this is the first time you've ever seen any of my videos, my name is James, or thanks, see ya. And if you'd like to see a few more, it'd be awesome if you considered subscribing to the channel or checking out some more videos of mine and if you do i hope you really enjoy them also once again if you enjoyed this video it'd be amazing if you wanted to leave me a rating that would be super special awesome but until next time thank you very much once again it has been a pleasure i'm gonna kill you thanks and see ya